Okay, so here we go. Let's talk about the next beta, iOS 18.1 Developer Beta 3. Now, I know a lot of you guys are looking forward to the next beta for iOS 18.1. And in today's video, I want to talk about a few things you should know in regards to new features coming to the next beta with iOS 18.1 Developer Beta 3. Now, for those of you that may be new to the channel, and I always like to clarify this so that everyone knows that Apple is currently testing two different versions of iOS 18. So iOS 18.1 point zero which is set to be released mid to late September. There it is. It is set to be released mid to late September and is currently sitting in beta seven. We could see another beta. We'll talk about the release date for that as well. And obviously Apple is also testing iOS 18.1, which is the main focus of today's video. We're expecting beta three. And let's talk about some of the new features expected with this software. And then we'll talk about the release dates for the next beta and the official software release. So the first thing I wanna talk about is cleanup. Cleanup is a new feature that could be coming to the Photos application with iOS 18.1 developer beta 3. So basically this feature uses AI or Apple intelligence to clear some of your images. So for example, if you're taking a family picture, you can circle a subject and it will remove that subject from the background. So cleaning up the image for you, as you can see right there, this is what the UI looks like. And Apple is rumored to be adding this feature to the next beta with iOS 18.1 developer beta 3. Now Apple is also rumored to be adding image one, which allows you to obviously use Apple intelligence to enhance images as well on your iPhone and or iPad. Now, there's a few things you guys have been asking about in regards to iOS 18.1 as Apple intelligence continues to be tested here. Where is Image Playground? And to be honest, we haven't heard anything in regards to Image Playground hitting iOS 18.1 just yet, but hopefully within the next couple of betas, we'll start seeing some of this Image Playground. Obviously, these new features allow you to get very creative on your device creating custom images with Image Playground to share with other iOS users, alongside a Genmoji, which obviously allows you to create custom emojis on your iPhone. And we haven't heard anything in regards to Genmoji either, but hopefully we'll see a glance of this with the next beta, but we haven't heard anything in regards to that. Hopefully with beta four, perhaps beta five with iOS 18.1, we'll get some of those Genmoji features in Image Playground, but we're hearing that cleanup is coming to the Photos application with 18.1 beta three and Image Wand as well. Now, in regards to release dates, I wanna say that iOS 18.1 developer beta three will release this week. I'm pretty certain of that. There's two weeks release schedule right now for betas on iOS 18.1 and today, actually marks the two weeks right there, as you can see. So iOS 18.1 developer beta three could release today on Monday, August the 26th. Maybe perhaps by the time you watch this video is already out. So make sure to stay tuned for the full coverage on that. And in regards to iOS 18, we could even see another beta for this software as well. Now iOS 18, as I mentioned, is currently sitting in beta seven. We're just a couple of weeks from the official release of this software, but we could see another beta, beta eight this week alongside 18.1 beta three as well. Well, if Apple does not release any betas for iOS 18.0, expect a release candidate in just a couple of days, and then Apple will officially release iOS 18 in September. But keep in mind that iOS 18 is set to be released mid to late September, and 18.1 is set to be released mid to late October with Apple Intelligence. So keep in mind, this week could be a big week with betas for 18 and 18.1. Just a quick update before the update, most likely happening this week, perhaps even today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.